Hey there, I'm Aramis, and this is the end of my first week as a full-time indie game developer. It feels wild to be saying that. I, I, I've, I've saved up so much, ruthlessly saved up so much money over the past kind of year and a half from my job so that I could make this decision. And it kind of snuck up on me a bit quicker than I expected. Um, but this first week was weird. It was a strange week. And I wanted to share that in kind of a weekly update with you. And I think this would be a fun series to continue in and publish a new video every Saturday or Sunday. So I'd love it if you kind of would join me every Saturday or Sunday, you know, look for this video to pop up, ask some questions down below that I could answer during this video and just share a very raw and unedited version of what that week was for me as a full-time indie game developer. Maybe you can learn from my mistakes or just find some entertainment and and laughing at the dancing monkey who is trying his best not to waste his life savings uh making a video game so this week i had planned um to take a break and i did that i took a step back i celebrated with some friends and, and family i went up to my cabin and, and hiked for a couple days and went and touched grass and and ate some good food and, and just had a really good time but then I decided to come back about Tuesday morning and I wanted to hit the ground running. I wanted to prove to myself that I had it in me to be a really productive full-time dev, that I could hit the ground running, that I could um, start live streaming immediately, that I could get a bunch of devlogs going and I got sick and that sucked. That sucked so much because there was already this weird feeling of inertia in our lives of how does our cadence of a daily life work? How does the, what time do you wake up at? What time do you go to bed at? When do you eat food? All of these things have inertia behind them. And I felt that a lot. And then hoping to take that break to kind of break up that monotony only to get sick, just kind of completely undercut, undercut the week for me. Um, th there's no other way of saying it. I, I wanted so much more from, from this first week and it didn't happen. And it was a bit of it out of my control. I ended up getting a fever. I watched Moana. Um, it's kind of my sick movie. I, I cried twice during it. The fever um, one, it's a really good movie. Don't get me wrong, but the fever also just kind of heightened all those emotions. Um, and then kind of woke up the next day and I felt a lot better. So I was able to get a little bit of progress on. I got a devlog out um, yesterday, which is uh, doing pretty well, hopefully sharing uh, a little bit of an insight into what a game development session looks like for me. And then this video is going to be a new series where I'm just hoping to share, like I said before, a raw take of what my week was like, share um, some of the challenges I'm facing um, and the struggles. So I'm hoping this next week I can really break up that inertia. I'm going to be starting to stream again over on Twitch. My plan right now is Tuesday through Friday from 11 a.m. Central Time to about 2 or 3 p.m. Central Time. And that'll adjust as uh, as kind of the, the inertia of this new journey takes over. Um, I can't tell you how excited I am to to wake up in the morning and and want to be awake um and want to go and and hop over here into my office and start working on things it is a really cool and unique feeling and i'm trying to appreciate that for what it is um so thank you thank you for joining me your feedback is going to be imperative to making this game a success to making this journey a success for me um, if you have questions that you want me to answer during these kind of high level weekly overviews, please leave them below or come join me in the discord, or you can come check me out live on Twitch next week. Um, thank you so much. I hope you're having a really solid weekend. Um, I know I am. Um, I'm excited to, to dive in and, and keep this going. So thank you so much. I've been here, miss. Have a great day.